Hello and welcome to Microsoft Word 2010 Working with Pictures. Today's lesson, Crop to Shape feature. Cropping to Shape is a really fun and easy feature to use, a great way to enhance your pictures. First thing you do, get your picture, then left click. Now up at the top you will notice Picture Tools became uh, active and so did the format. Go ahead and click Format, slide on all the way over to the Crop button. The Crop button is in two pieces. Clicking on the top part you will get your standard regular cropping tools. Clicking on the bottom part when it's highlighted with the little arrow give that a click. Oh my, look at all the little toys we have. This is your regular standard cropping tool. Now crop to shape will bring up, you don't have to click on it, it'll do it by itself, will bring up all the shapes that come with Word 2010. Myself, I'm going to pick on the cloud. Just click the shape and boom. Well, that doesn't look like much happened, did it? Okay, that's because by default Word 2010 will crop to shape with no lines. Simply left click on your image, right click, and click Format Picture. There's the magic box. By default it will open to picture corrections. Let's move this box over so we can see the box and the image. Because any changes we make in the box will be reflected on the image near immediately. We want lines, so we go up to line color, give that a click, it says no line, give it a solid line. By default you will get light blue. Me, I'm going to change that to black, but you can change it to any color, you know, of the rainbow that you wish. If you want the line, now you see it's all black. If you want the line thicker, go downstairs one step to line style. Width. The bigger the number, well, you get you see the thicker the line, okay? I'm going to bring it right back to one point. One point there. Okay? Click close. Now, what if you want more control over this? What if you want to play with this a little bit? Simply click on the uh image. Now, the corner handles here will uh uniformly make it bigger or smaller. It won't really do anything. It just makes them bigger or smaller. The side handles will manipulate your entire image but you see it stretches it will stretch things well what if you don't want to stretch it okay not a problem word 2010 has more tools for that right click go to format picture there's our magic box we're going to go all the way down to crop give that a click now we have two sets of controls here we have picture position this will manipulate the picture itself inside the shape, leaving the shape alone. Crop position will manipulate the shape, but leave the picture alone. Let's see how this works. The first two set of controls on either one control the left and the right of things. The next two sets of controls will control the up and down, or top and bottom, of things. Let's see how this works. Picture position, we're going to manipulate the picture only. The top box will stretch, let me click, will stretch or squish the image. The bottom box will move the entire image, left or right. Again, the first set is for left and right. Now the next set of controls are for up and down. Again, the top box will do the stretching or the squishing and the bottom box will move the entire thing up or down. Crop position does exactly the same thing only to the shape not the picture. Meaning here we are with the left and right of things it will squish you can see over here how it's uh, getting longer see how it's getting shorter it will squish or stretch and the bottom control, of course, will move the entire shape left or right. Okay. Again, the next set of controls are for the top and bottom of things. This will top one will stretch or squish our shape, and the bottom one will, of course, move up or down the shape. And 
I tell you the truth, that is about it. Click close. That is the crop to shape feature. It is really easy to use. Oh, what if you want to change your shape? You change your mind. Not a problem. Left click, format, go to the bottom box, crop to shape, and click another shape. Boom, there's kitty and an arrow. <laughs> Again, format, hit the crop with the arrow, crop to shape. Uh, let's put the kitty in a circle. It's just that easy. I'm going to go right back and put it back in the cloud here. <laughs> I like kitties in the cloud. Alrighty, that is the crop to shape feature in Word 2010. It's really easy and really fun. I hope you learned a lot from this video, and I do hope you have a very good day.